Hey everyone, how's it going? Chris from Blu-ray Critic, and on today's update, we're going to take a look at the 4K edition of uh, one of the most anticipated action-adventure films of this summer, and that is uh, Suicide Squad with uh, Will Smith, Jared Leto, and Margot Robbie. So the story centers around a U.S. intelligence officer who decides to assemble a team of dangerous but yet incarcerated supervillains for a top-secret mission, you know, armed with government weapons, you know, dead shots in the film played by Will Smith, and such a badass role for him, I absolutely love this character. Along with Harley Quinn, played by Margot Robbie, you know, Captain Boomerang's in the film, Killer Croc, and the rest of the gangs must learn how to work together, even though they just really don't like each other, you know, to uh, basically uh, unite and battle a mysterious, powerful entity, along with the uh, crazy Joker, played by Jared Leto, and what a performance by him, and I would rank his performance up there with Jack Nicholson and the late, great Heath Ledger, although I still think Heath Ledger is number one as far as how he was able to perform that Joker role in The Dark Knight, which was absolutely incredible, and a well-deserved Oscar by, uh, you know, Heath Ledger when he got one after he passed. But uh, yeah, so that's essentially what the film is about. It's just action-packed all the way. And uh, it's just one of those films you want to grab a bucket of popcorn and enjoy it for what it is. And as far as the extended cut of the film, that is only included on the uh, regular Blu-ray edition. So if you want to check out the uh, theatrical cut, you got to check it out on the uh, 4K disc. But um, as far as bonus content, you get several great behind-the-scenes featurettes, one of which is called Task Force X, One Team, One Mission. Discover the rich legacy of DC's most infamous bad guys, as well as uh, squad strength and skills, how they whip themselves into shape. You also get uh, Joker and Harley, the it couple of the underworld, plus uh, Chasing the Real. Writer-director David Iyer reveals uh, techniques for creating the authentic uh, surreal world plus the gag rail and much more. And this film is presented in the aspect ratio of 2.41. And as far as the runtime on the film, the theatrical cut clocks in at 123 minutes and the extended cut is 134 minutes. But if you haven't upgraded to 4K, these are the type of films you want to upgrade to to really experience that uh, you know, significant difference between uh, Blu-ray and that HDR, the high dynamic range. But uh, the 4K edition, I'm going to rate that a solid 5 out of 5 for both picture and audio. And the audio mix is a Dolby Atmos 7.1 track, which is absolutely fantastic. And uh, yeah, it's just sharp, and just the overall clarity is there comparing it to the regular Blu-ray. The regular Blu-ray is still good. Um, however, it's just slightly soft comparing it to the 4K. But nonetheless, it's still a pristine uh, presentation with the Dolby 7.1 mix as well. And that's the 4K disc, and uh, you get the digital HD code. And by the way, the digital HD code holds both versions of the film, the theatrical as well as the extended cut, so that's pretty cool. And that's the regular Blu-ray. So in conclusion, this is another solid release by Warner and the folks over at DC Universe. And uh, yeah, definitely check out that extended cut. It really does make a difference over the theatrical. But uh, yeah, so that's Suicide Squad making its uh, 4K and regular Blu-ray debut. Thanks for taking a look, and I'll see you guys soon in my next review. Take care.